Anyway, I just had it reset, uh, and the reset for the E is not a sort of hold a couple of buttons deal. What you gotta do is purge the memory, because remember, when the battery died, everything that was there, whiskey, tango, uniform. So, what you gotta do is clear the memory, and that's the most important step. I'm going to insert um, other steps into um, description. Let's do it, I'll just put it in the description. No links, it'll just be straight up, sort of a quick write up on what to do. A copy paste from the manual. Anyway, let's try it. I'll try to explain it best I can. Uh, I, I don't have the ability to point cameras at things. I don't have a freaking camera crew. I've only got about 10 minutes to do this whole thing. So, this is my way of trying to answer your question on my free time, you know? Anyway, what you gotta do is first select the bank. So I'm gonna select bank zero, AKA bank one. All right, so move the slider, push whatever voice button you want. And now we're gonna hit function button and now we're gonna hit operate select button twice and button 31 twice. Okay, that pretty much set internal memory protect to off. Okay, that's the way it's done on E card. Yes, in the future we will do a full tutorial on E. This isn't it. This is quick steps to get your E up and running after replacing the battery. After that, while we're still in the memory page, we're going to hit button 20, and we're going to make sure that it's set to voice. Mine already is, okay? But make sure button 20, memory page says voice, okay? Then you got to hit your button number 19 three times. Yeah, click those heels. Um, and then you basically say yes to erase bank, and you confirm. And you got to do this for all of the 10 banks. I'm not going to do that right now. No tiempo. Okay. And here we've got, um, if you hit that button one more time, you'll be able to erase your, your patch map, which you should absolutely erase if it's corrupt. And then you should erase your keyboard presets. Okay. After that, your only concern is, you know, after you're done deleting all the banks and all that stuff, your only concern is you got to go to your regular function page. You got to make sure that your pitch band's okay, the range is okay, the step is off, portamento this, portamento that. Just make sure it's not some random weird values. Um, after this, you may want to go to your MIDI page and just make sure that your MIDI channel your in MIDI channel and your out MIDI channel are set to one. Uh, make sure your keyboard um, uh, mode is normal, not some kind of a split or whatever. Uh, just normal things because remember, outside of erasing the voice memory, outside of erasing all the sort of memory that it, all the stuff that it's been storing, all the other parameters are like basically set to random values. So your key shift, your ranges, I've listed all of that in the description. That's your steps. But one, once you replace the battery on your E, you're gonna get an error message, do not freak out. Two, follow the instructions, follow the steps, and understand that all you're doing, you're just clearing your memory and you're setting parameters to where they're supposed to be. So they're not at some strange random values. Hopefully this teaches you all, anyway. <laughs>